Yo, welcome to feeding time. I am the big guy Ryback. Beautiful Sunday morning, light breeze here at uh, Casa de la Big Guy. Today, guys, decided we're gonna do a breakfast again. It's Sunday breakfast with the big guy. It's nice. And uh, I have uh, I crossed the border and went to Mexico. And uh, I've got a Taco Bell breakfast today. I've heard people we've done we've done some breakfast things here and people are like you're missing out on taco bell breakfast you're missing out on taco bell breakfast well i'm not missing out now guys i've never had taco bell breakfast by the way so i'm gonna what the got a hash brown that's deformed the jeffrey <laughs> all right we got a whole bunch of stuff here and then I got some sauces in the bag. Sweet. I'll probably use some sauces on the burritos. Let's get those. Put those right there. Ah. Wake up unlimited energy. Wake up unlimited energy. Ah. Let me dive in. I uh, had my stem cell procedure on Monday. It's my first time doing a video all week. I got to do quite a few videos today. Takes a lot out of me, guys. You guys really zap the fucking energy out of me. I'm not gonna lie. I just, uh, just figured Sunday, my my day of videos, I'm recording all during the week, doing two different podcasts, getting guests for the show, and I mean that's this shit stressful. All right. So what do I got here? We got breakfast burrito things. These I don't know. There's one with potato, one without potato. We'll go with the one without potato to start. We're gonna go a little, we'll go a little mild. That's you, bitch, mild. You're damn right. Eat enough hot sauces during the week. I actually got to do a ride back has heat video here. I know some of you fucking weirdos like to actually see this shit. Why I no fucking clue. That's why I talk in these guys, because it would just be weird if I was just eating and not talking for me. So even if I lose views, at least I feel good about myself spreading some knowledge of things I've learned. You're not fucking smart. I'm smarter than you, Jeffrey and Karen. Thank you all. Enjoy. Mmm. Sauce is spilling on the side. Done. God, this would be so good if I was really fucked up. Maybe I should stop this and get really fucked up. Too early for that big guy. I got a bottle of the Rocks Terramana tequila in front. Is the Rock promoting alcoholism? He's always drinking now, I've noticed. It must be really good, though. He's a smart man, though. He's bringing people together. That's the play. Brilliant fucking man. Brilliant. Brilliant play. The alcohol's where it's at. Stone Cold with the beer. Rock and Connor with the, the tequila and the Irish whiskey, respectively. The big guy with the supplements. Don't sleep on the big guy. It's a huge industry, although alcohol is, is not never going anywhere. But with this day and age and the viruses, health and fitness are top priority. As I stuck my face with the unhealthiest of unhealthiest of foods. It's my cheat meal though. What do we got here? Well, this is the Jeffrey hash brown. You can see it's broken. There's just no chance of ever repairing it or fixing it. Like even if you try to make it look like it's all right, it's not. That's Jeffrey and Karen for you guys. Mm. I don't think I've ever had a bad hash brown.
Too bad there's no ketchup. Wait, aren't there? No. Just hot sauce. I don't need any. It's so good. Who's some people you guys would like to see on my podcast? Conversation with the big guy Ryback. Let me know in the comments. Had uh, Dylan Bostic, who was actually one of the guys that was one of the two-on-one matches early on in my career. And I wrestled him several times on the independence. Great guy. He actually has a kid on the way. He's 28. Fantastic wrestler. I'm, I'm a fan of his. So, he's on this week. It's always nice to... Uh, People I have a history with one way or the other, get them on the show. All righty. We're going to do the one. We're going to go a hot sauce here. This is the uh, breakfast burrito with potato. Potato, potato. Either one offends fucking Jeffrey and Karen. Guess what, Jeffrey and Karen? I'm offended that you're offended. How about that? You know what happens when you're offended that someone's offended? Get rid of all the rules. You know, Jeffrey and Karen, you know what happens, huh? Huh? You fight. Well, you don't like to fight. You say you don't like physical confrontation. Well, I do. Let's throw us in the little fucking gladiator pit and see who walks out alive. Huh, Jeffrey and Karen? Two on one matchup. Taco Bell breakfast. Am I the only one that thinks it's odd that we have breakfast foods? Like, do you think like, humans like distinguished like at the time of the day before? Like, I could only eat scrambled eggs and bacon between six and nine a.m. Any other time, it's unacceptable. Or like, does our body and they like, have this like mechanism in it that like where it knows breakfast foods i'm telling you humans are fucking dumb you just eat whatever you want whenever you want and try to be healthy not like like why can't you wake up and if you want a steak for breakfast why can't you just make a steak and a potato there's something with your body not registered too early too early too early These are the shit, the kind of things that go through my head as a, as a young child, guys. Donuts, why can't we only eat donuts in the morning? Why can't we eat donuts fucking before we go to bed? Granted, that's not, never a good time to eat donuts, but. You know, what about after a baseball game? Why can't I have some donuts after a baseball game? Do I have to wake up and see them on the table to be able to eat them? Uh, okay, we got a big burrito here. This is, uh. A steak. Fucking jack. You can tell this one's definitely a little bit bigger. That's what she said. <laughs> We're going to do two sauces with this because it's so fucking big. We're going to go a mild and a hot. I know in some of my videos, guys, some of you would like to see the food. And you want me to somehow like adjust the camera, lower it, maybe where it's just hitting the top of my head down. I don't give a fuck what you think. I enjoy this shot. And I know what I'm doing. I'm not trying to win any Guinness Book of World Records here. This is all for haha. -ha. So I'm sorry if you can't, you know, I put it up. I, I give it, I show you. I'm not a total asshole, but you know. I also don't give a fuck what you think, good or bad. I know who and what I am and what I'm doing. I just go about my day. And I sleep beautifully doing that. I also use my GTS Go to Sleep Sleep Aid. 
ultra high powered sleep formula by Feed Me More Nutrition available on feedmemore.com and Amazon. Mm. Oh shit. Little potatoes squeaked away. Eggs, tomatoes, steak. I think there's only one piece of steak in this whole thing. It's right there. I lied, there's more steak. brown and then I got the crunch wrap spitting all over the place I think I'm gonna put a hot sauce on the hash brown we're gonna see how that goes don't do it big guy don't do it shut the fuck up Hot sauce really does make everything taste better. Mm. I don't regret that at all. My shoulder's feeling really good. I've taken all week off of weights. But as you can see on the thumbnail, I'm still fucking Jack. <clears throat> you don't lose your muscle that quickly, especially when it's real muscle. Not that fake artificially enhanced steroid muscle like some of the little bitches use out there. This is the crunch wrap breakfast thing. I guess I need hot sauce for this too. I'm gonna actually, oh wait, should I open this up and ruin their design? Oh, no, we don't want to do that. We're just going to put it on top, just like we've been doing. I was actually going too low on my carbs for too long. I've been doing my, during the week doing my vegetables and getting my carbs primarily from greens, which was really low. And I noticed, especially when I do my laps early in the morning, my, I was fatiguing. And not like out of breath fatiguing, just like wanted to take a nap fatigue. I actually took a nap for the first time the other early in the week with the dogs for like 15 minutes. I haven't done that and I can't tell you how long. And I realized, I go, I need it, I, I need at least, I, I've upped my carbs, we're doing about 250 grams a day on the other, and then I'm gonna alter, I'm gonna go see how that goes for a bit. But what happens essentially is it slows your metabolism too when you don't eat enough carbs. Especially for me, like I function really well off carbohydrates, keeping my fats lower. So, which again, this is not, does not apply to my cheat meal here. Some people don't seem to understand that when you work out for hours on end every day and, and having one meal, and, you know, shit, I could do this all day. And it's not gonna, the amount that I work out, it's just not, you don't, internally wise, you don't wanna do this all the time. Mm. Mm. I think they got nacho cheeses and hash browns in this. Oh, this is unbelievable. Mmm.
Ah, crap. Oh, no. It's going to hell at the end. That's how I used to eat back in the Neanderthal days. Oh, this is messy. God, if my neighbors look out the window, I must look like such a piece of shit. No, oh, this is the big guy again doing his little fucking YouTube video. Loser! Fuck you, Karen. I was here first. All right, clean off this little outside table. I love this table. Looks like it's due for another pressure wash soon with all this food I'm eating out here lately. Done. All right, guys, that was the uh, Taco Bell breakfast mukbang review. Yeah, I haven't done the review yet. Um, I didn't know what to expect. Uh, Taco Bell's been on a... Uh, look how fucking big my trap is when we just adjust my arm. Jesus, fuck. It's so fucking big, I can't even fucking look behind me. Um, they didn't know what to expect with that, guys. And uh, I was pleasantly, pleasantly pleased. Pleasantly pleased? Yeah, pleasantly pleased. That works. Excuse me. Out of five stars... Actually, what I'm going to do, the, 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 the crunch wrap was by far my favorite thing out of all that. Followed up by the steak. Kind of in the order that I ate it, reversed. The crunch wrap was my favorite. The steak burrito was right behind it. And then the potato, the sausage, or the, the, the breakfast burrito with potato. And then the breakfast burrito without potato. I think I had almost their whole menu for the breakfast. I didn't quite have everything. I'm giving this, and the hash browns were, they're just, again, just factory line those in my fucking mouth. Um, we're giving that 4.8 stars out of five on the thumbs up scale. Right there, almost, almost double thumbs up. Just delightful. Taco Bell, it's not your, your typical breakfast, but it works. It's, it's not healthy either, guys. So I can't, I can't stress that enough for you out there as a disclaimer that if you're not working out, you don't take care of yourself, you smoke a pack or two of Marlboros a day, maybe you're chewing tobacco, you fucking pour Cokes down your mouth, uh, relentlessly throughout the day, playing video games, smoking, drinking cokes, popping fucking blue chews or something, jerking off the porn several times a day. Don't eat this, guys. Even though the jerking off the porn is technically burning calories and getting your heart rate up probably a little bit, eh, you can keep doing that, I guess. You're being active one way or the other. I'd hate to have you replace that with more cokes and cigarettes. No, honestly. What am I talking about? I don't know, guys. But I like to leave you with a little something, something each and every week. And uh, happiness, happiness is a choice, guys. You hear people, you know, they, they pursue the, the journey of happiness and they attach happiness to a goal. I got news for you. You're going to spend your whole life not happy. It's right in front of you. It's a choice. It's a mindset. 
We have the choice each and every day and every moment to be happy or not. And if you think that doing something and the, the end of that something, something, you're going to be happy and happiness is all of a sudden going to be there, guess what? It's not because you don't have the mindset. You never made the choice to be happy. Fucking think about that, all right? Happiness is a choice. I'm the big guy, Ryback. You've just watched another edition of Feeding Time. Stay safe, stay healthy, get hungry, stay hungry, feed me more. Yo, thank you guys for watching Ryback TV. If you could check out my Shooting Blanks Wrestling Report every Monday on all podcast platforms, Conversation with the Big Guy Ryback every Thursday morning on all podcast platforms, and Feed Me More Nutrition, my personal supplement line, available on feedmemore.com and Amazon. Save 10% with discount code YouTube10 and save stupid. Why couldn't you? Almost had it. I almost had the whole video done in one take. <sighs> New customers, you can save 20% with discount code NEWCUSTOMER on feedmemore.com. Get hungry, stay hungry, feed me more.